Hey, good morning. It's Monday and I want to encourage you this morning that there is more with you and for you than there is against you. Don't allow yourself to, um, I would say, take on the weight of thinking that everybody's against you. They're not. And sometimes we get in those places in our emotions, right? When we're feeling lonely, when we're feeling um, hurt, when we're lost, you know, confused. Um, sometimes in our emotions, when they're not aligned with the word of God that brings life and health, right? When <laughs> That help that we need to understand what's going on mentally, physically, spiritually, that's those are places where the enemy comes and he attacks in those vulnerable places. But in Ephesians 6, 10, before God gives us the armor, he encourages us, listen, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. He wants you to be prepared. He wants you to be strong. He wants you to have provision, protection. He wants you to have stability. I talked about that on last Wednesday night Bible study. It's everything. Why? Because it keeps you from um, falling victim to the enemy's attacks, right? In First um, Peter 5, 8, it says, be sober and vigilant. This is what God is telling us to do. And we got to be aware and understand that this armor of God is not just to fight with, right? But it's to be protected by as well, right? It's offensive and it's defensive. And so it's, it puts us in that position that we are able to endure, right? Them that endure to the end. That has a lot to do with our emotions, what we were talking about last week, right? And how we, um, so I would say, submit our emotions, submit our thoughts under God and align those views, those perspectives, those desires, those wills with God's. And that scripture, 1 Peter 5, 8, be sober, vigilant. Your adversary, the devil, is like a roaring lion. He walks around seeking whom he may devour. Do not be a victim. Do not be a prey to the enemy because we refuse to be aware of what's going on inside of us. God wants us to be aware. He wants us to deal with what's going on, but also give it to him and allow the strength that we need to come from him. It's not in ourself, but it's all in him that worketh through us. God bless and have a wonderful day today.